What is going on guys? Today we are doing something a little bit different. It's kind of cold outside. It's like 14 or so degrees and the uh, the ice is kind of sketchy. It was really warm the last week so can't go ice fishing, can't go normal fishing. So we are going to do something a little bit different. Sir, where are you guys' uh, bullet torches at? Bullet torches should be over in aisles 13, 14. Well, I just spent $65 on blow torches. Just to put this into perspective of what, what I just did, I walked into Lowe's wearing a Harambe Loved Christmas sweater, a goofy American flag like Eskimo hat, and I bought five blow torches and three knives. So I'm not sure exactly what the workers were thinking. I kind of felt bad for them because they probably thought I was about to do some crazy stuff, which hopefully this doesn't turn into anything too crazy. You know, I don't want to burn my house down. Uh, but today is going to be kind of fun. This is kind of a day, like like I said, I couldn't go fishing. I really don't have any plans. It's New Year's Eve. You know, I'm going to kick it tonight. So, you know, this is kind of a last second thing. You guys, I'm sure you guys have seen this on YouTube. There's been a lot of videos going around doing this thing. But I figured no one is going to do the fishing one. So why not me? So to give you guys an idea of what I'm going to do, I've got, like I said, five blow torches in which I got to somehow figure out how to hook up. I've got a swim bait. I've got a fishing reel. I've got a spool of line. I've got a top topwater frog there. I've got a little pack of Sankos, I've got a walking bait, and I've got a, uh, a fishing rod. Those are all the things that I am going to attempt to like cut in half slash destroy. Uh, if you guys don't know what I'm doing right now, I'm taking blow torches and I'm heating up the knives until they are a thousand degrees, nice and bright, orange and red, and then try to chop stuff in half. So that's what I'm doing today. Hopefully you guys enjoy. Gotta hook up the other uh, other two, and we are good to go. Well, we're ready to go. We got three uh, three kitchen knives, and one, two. That's what we've got. Three kitchen knives, three blow torches. Let's do this. So I'm gonna start off with the uh, spool of line. I'm just gonna kind of go through each one of these things. Um, I'm kind of excited to see like. You know, if this is gonna be able to cut the fishing, I mean, it's a thousand degree knife. I could see it for sure cutting the cutting the fishing reel up. I'm gonna start with this and just kind of go through the line of all the baits and the tackle boxes and stuff like that. Sit back and enjoy the uh, the video, and hopefully, I don't burn my house down. Oh, this smells awful. Oh. Well, I'm not sure if ever, you know, sleeping at night, you're ever dreaming about what it looked like to cut an entire giant thousand yard spool in half. I thought that was pretty cool. It smells like actually awful. This is like burnt rubber. Um, I don't even know. It's, I mean, it's fluorocarbon, but this, uh, this stuff, I thought, it, I thought it actually turned out looking, looking pretty sweet. So that was, that was the first one. Uh, we're gonna do that and then we're gonna get through the rest of these, but I'm actually fairly impressed with the, uh, the first. This thing's actually a lot more fun. I understand now why people are doing it on YouTube because this is actually pretty sweet. I think this goes without saying, uh, but don't do this at home. Just set off the fire alarm in my house and uh, now I'm scrambling to try, to try to get everything under control. I didn't, I didn't say this before, but I figured you guys could just assume it. Do not try this at home. That dude right there is, uh, he's pretty well toast. That was kind of a cool one. It made a lot of smoke though, so I'm, I'm just kind of waiting any second now. <coughs> oh my God, do not, <coughs> do not <coughs> do this inside. Ooh, this smells awful, but this, uh, that was, I thought that was a pretty cool one. That, that uh, pretty much destroyed that little frog there. Next, we are going to try to cut this uh, little topwater walking bait in half. I thought 
that one uh, actually turned out pretty sweet. I did not expect to actually cut this in half uh, with the knife. I thought for sure that it wasn't uh, it wasn't going to, but you guys can see there, got it in, in four little pieces. That was the top water walking bait. Now we are going to uh, melt the uh, swim bait. This one didn't really come as much as a surprise, you know, obviously Senkos aren't the most durable things in the world, but I thought it was pretty, pretty cool, you know, it's kind of just destroying swim baits and stuff. Now we're getting to the, uh, the interesting part, the part where I have absolutely no idea whether it's going to work or not, and that is the fishing reel and, and the uh, fishing rod. And by the way, this rod's already broken, so I don't want any hater comments saying that this could have gone to charity because it's literally snapped. It snapped off right there. The uh, the tip's missing, and this reel right here, the uh, the drag doesn't work. Like you can just you can just pull a line out. The drag doesn't work. So I don't want any hater comments saying that I could have donated this stuff. So now we are going to get into uh, into this. I'm gonna save the reel for last because that's the one I'm most excited about. I'm gonna do the the rod and see if this thousand degree knife can cut this uh, this rod in half. This one was a this one was a struggle for sure. You guys can see I, I got it cut in half. That didn't really have as cool of a of a deal like a a result that uh, I expected. I don't know. I expected this thing just like light and fire and do something cool. I mean, it's still pretty cool to see like what it looks like for a rod to be kind of cut in half. That's what that's what they look like for those of you guys that don't know. I thought that was pretty sweet. Now for the grand finale. I have no idea what this is gonna do. This is either gonna be really sick or it's gonna be super lame and the knife isn't gonna do anything. But I'm gonna do my best. I'm gonna do my absolute best to uh, destroy this reel and hopefully cut it in half. Well, I honestly don't think I've ever been so disappointed in my life. So I know that you guys are disappointed. That was weak sauce. That was 110% super weak. So I'm gonna go outside. I'm destroying this reel. One way or another, I'm destroying this reel. Well, folks, this is where I end the video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. This is just kind of like a like a chill end of the year, have fun type video. This wasn't like anything serious. I thought it was just kind of fun to like experiment, you know. I was disappointed. I know some of you guys are probably gonna like hit the dislike button and just roast my ass in the comment section about how I named it the bait cast or cutting in half or whatever I named it and it didn't work. I know, I know, it sucked. It it, it did. It really did suck. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna sit here and act like I thought that this video was epic. You know, it was kind of cool. I suppose the line was cool, you know, the frog, and the, all those things were pretty sweet. Um, the baitcaster did not break in half. So, 
my next mission, my, my, my next goal in life is to find a way to cut that thing in half. I don't care what I have to do to do it, I'm gonna figure out how to do it. Now, if you guys enjoyed this video and you wanna see more stuff like it, leave a thumbs up and drop a comment down below. Uh, just tell me that you enjoyed it or what you want me to cut in half next. You want me to cut my truck in half, my boat, a kayak. You guys let me know, just drop a comment down below what you guys wanna see cut in half with a thousand degree knife. I hope you guys have a fantastic New Year's. I'm just gonna go kick it tonight, have fun, relax. I want you guys to do the same. It's gonna be a sick 2017, guys, I can promise you. 2017 is going to be absolutely just ridiculously awesome. I'm super excited and I cannot wait. Thank you all so much for watching and peace.